Hello everyone and welcome back to Stardew Valley. Picking up right where we left off. Well, let's take a look at the TV here. It's gonna rain all day tomorrow, so we'll probably go to the mines. And the spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Luck will not be on our side. Okay, first things first, a little housekeeping. I'm working on getting the audio fixed. I know my videos in this series so far have been bizarrely quiet. I think I've at the very least made it better, but let me know. It might be worse, it might be the same. Um, either way, once this one's finished and uploaded, I'll be able to tell a little bit better how it went, and then hopefully I can continue to improve it from there. Okay, so we have all this in our inventory because we were going to go do uh, the silo today. So let's go ahead and we're going to save two cauliflower. Whoops! We're going to save two cauliflower. One for the CC and one because I believe Jody asks for one at some point. Then we're going to sell um, these. Uh, okay, let's read the mail. Dear neighbor, I hope you are feeling settled in your new home. I am writing to let you know that Pierre's store is now selling fertilizers. Why don't you swing by and see if you can afford a few dozen boxes or so. Pierre, I gotta be honest with you, I'm probably not gonna do that. Because we're gonna make our own. Um, and it's Tuesday, so Pierre's is not closed. So we will probably buy some more seeds today. It's really bugging me how bad these gardens are, but uh, not much I can do about it when everything is growing out of sync. We will fix it in the summertime. Whoops! I just double watered a spot, which is not great when you're trying to save your energy. Oh, God. Watering can's got to be... Actually, you know what? I, honestly, I think pickaxe has to be next, and then watering can for our upgrades. Um, yeah, I'm not too worried about the hoe. We'll do it last. Yeah, so we're getting... We did the axe first so that we can chop down the big stumps so that we can get... Whoops, come on. I feel like my indicator was on that one, and it just went ahead and did a different one. Good morning, kitty. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, chopping down the big stumps so that we can get mahogany seeds so we can plant the mahogany tree, which we can then uh, use to harvest sap. Um, okay. I see it's seven berry season, so I'm actually just going to quickly grab these. Seven berry season is both good in year one for making money, and it's also good for energy early on. Um, okay, so we have our five cup. What does the silo cost again? Do we have enough to upgrade a tool and get the silo? Oh yeah, silo is a hundred bucks. So we absolutely do. Um, so let's go. We're going to Clint's, so let's bring all the museum stuff too. Um, then bring five more copper bars. It's going to be five for the silo, five more for our next tool. It is going to rain tomorrow, which means we're dropping off our watering can today. Uh, that's the plan now. Let's go execute it. This is going to be probably a little frustrating to watch because I'm going to go get the salmon berries every time I see a bush that has them. Oh, well, how are we doing on quests? Clint wants copper more, copper ores, nine more. I missed the days before this was patched out. You used to just be able to pull them out of a chest. So if you had 30 ore in a chest, pulling them out of the chest into your inventory counted as collecting them. But unless I'm mistaken, that has since been fixed. Um, Linus like a topaz. It's probably not going to happen, but we'll accept the quest because if it does happen, we'll make Linus happy. Now let's do Quince first, because we might get some um, donatables in this these geodes, pardon me. Alright, got the copper axe. Thank you, sir. Process my geodes, please. My voice just cracked. My geodes! Um, okay, haven't donated that. Haven't donated that. 
That's a lump of coal. That's a double. And I don't believe we've donated that. We have not. So we're probably getting a reward here because that's a lot of stuff to be donated. Uh, how you doing, Gunther? One, two, there's one reward. There's two rewards. Okay. We'll settle for two, I guess. Got the standing geode and the a knight on Echo Hill. Eco Hill? Doesn't matter. It's a painting of a hill. All right, let's do CC next. Oh, wait, nope, sorry. What? It's gonna rain tomorrow, so take my watering can. Thank you, sir. And we are officially dead broke again. We have a really crappy sword. I wonder if there's a better one for sale in the Adventurer's Guild yet. All right, CC Robbins, back to the farm to try and get a mahogany seed, and then we'll regroup and see where we're at. I saw more salmon berries. Um, spring crops. Still waiting on that green bean, but we're almost there. Um, did we finish spring foraging? We we did, right? Yeah, we did. Okay. Right, that's how we got the the fish tank unlocked. We gotta finish another bundle to get the boiler room. And then we can get the uh the mine carts. Sorry. Uh, my mouse hand was occupied. I forgot that I was going to need it to grab those berries. All right, is Robin even working on Tuesdays at 12.30? No, she's not. <laughs> hey, but look at that. We get to go this way and get salmon berries. I'm sure... Most people who have played this game as much as I have, including most of you in the comments, um, have Robin's schedule memorized and were probably screaming at me not to bother to go up there. And you've been right. Fair is fair. Credit where credit's due. I'm going to go get those berries too by the bus stop. Oh, come on now. Oh, come on now. I can't hit this yet, can I? Or at all? No, we need a magnet ring. All right. Well, that kind of sucks. Oh, by the way, I'm sure you all know this, but I haven't shown it off in this playthrough yet. The uh, greenhouse is over here on this little island, which I think is awesome. And then Grandpa's Shrine is up here. Yeah, I kind of just dove into this playthrough without a lot of, like, discussing anything. Anything else to forage? Can I grab the seeds? Can I grab the seeds? Thank you. I really can't wait to unlock the islands. I was revisiting um, Poe Carnage when he played the update. And the island just looks so fun. I have had a decent amount of it spoiled for me just from having watched people play it over the last year or however long it's been since it first came out, but certainly not stuff I have memorized. And as you can tell from having watched me at all, I do not commit things to memory very well. Why did I go back? What was the plan there? Okay, first of all, I'm hitting the wrong buttons all over the damn place. Um, that's good. Everything's back how I like it. Now let's try and get a mahogany seed. And once the silo is built, we can take care of all this damn grass. Okay, none so far. Still none. 
Whoops. What's going on here? Is that a stump? It is. Okay, let me make sure I didn't read this wrong. We're going to the wiki, guys. We're going to type in mahogany seed. It can be obtained by shaking or chopping down a mahogany tree. Duh. Chopping a large stump or a large log. And, okay. I wonder what the drop rate is because we've already hit quite a few and we haven't gotten one yet. Can we get to the secret forest with um, a copper axe or do we need um, iron to get the, uh, the big log out of the way? I don't remember. <clears throat> All right, we're starting to feel exhausted. Good thing we have 49 salmon berries. All right, I'm feeling less good about our chances to get this damn seed drop. Mahogany seed, hell yeah. Um, do trees grow on the beach? They must. Oh, of course they do. What a stupid question. Just look at the screen. Okay, so let's plant this somewhere while I remember that it's the mahogany one and not chop it down like an imbecile. Um, let's drop it like right there. Um... Am I anywhere close? Oh, I can't water it. I don't think you have to, though. Am I anywhere close to being able to make tree fertilizer, or is that, like, way down the line? Anyway, while we're at it, we might as well get rid of all these, and there's another mahogany seed. We're going to have a nice collection of hardwood right off the bat. Which do we have the, um, no, I don't see a pulse. What's it called? The construction bundle? I think that's one of the possible um, foraging bundles. Does that even need hardwood? Am I am I making a fool of myself? Maybe it's just wood and stone. I can't remember. I want to get the hardwood front and center just so I can see how much we're collecting. Okay, so tomorrow while our watering can's being worked on and while it's raining, we're gonna to go to the mine. So I want to get down there as quick as possible. Okay, there might be more, but I think I'm done chopping wood for the day. Got to save some excitement for tomorrow. You know what I'm talking about. Um, okay. Should I plant two? I mean, I don't see why not. Okay, so wait, wait, wait. So to get this symmetrical, it'd be about there. Is that right? You see what I'm saying? Like direct line from the staircase to there, direct line from the staircase. Yeah, I think, yeah, it's good enough if it's not right. Um, okay, we're gonna hop in here. We're not gonna add the stacks because we'll lose all our stuff. But if I don't mention that, people go, um, hey, you know that you can just click and add everything to the same stack now, right? And I do know that. Okay, coal. We're going to sell that, sell the oyster. We don't need the oyster, do we? No. Actually, speaking of oysters... What's the crab pot recipe? Three iron bars. Okay, we, yeah, we have three iron ore, so we're not exactly close. We got to get down to the iron levels in the mines. 
So that'll be what we do tomorrow. That there for now. That looks horrendous. What are you going to do? All right, what do we do with the next three hours of our evening? Require spun coal. I was not trying to put salmon berries into the furnace. Okay, let's not eat too many, because if we eat more than we ended up needing, then we just look foolish. You know, let's go to the let's just go let's just fish on the farm. It's uh it's the beach farm after all. Let's head down to the dock. Best way to get to the dock. Am I doing it? Oh, and actually, I'm going to check. Can the copper do this? Nope. You need iron. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Um, One sec. I up certain settings in my OBS in my attempts to make my audio sound better. I did some other unrelated things that like slightly boost the CPU usage. And like my my PC is no slouch. It's not it's not great, but it's not terrible. And at the moment I am running Stardew Valley, which can run on a phone. I am running my internet browser with only the wiki open, and I'm running OBS. And my computer is making noises like I'm playing fucking Call of Duty. Which I find a little bit excessive. I want it to just take a deep breath. I find it really inconsistent what my computer decides to um, rev its engines about. I did like eight hour straight sessions of Valheim with no issues, but then I'll boot up like Frostpunk and it's like an airplane taking off. Oh, the it's getting late notification tricked my brain into thinking there was a, uh, a bite. I've got the volume turned down pretty low so I can hear myself talk better. All right, well, it's basically one in the morning. And we have two fish. So I think it's safe to say this was a pretty unsuccessful fishing expedition. Do like maybe one more cast after this. Anchovy. All right, screw it, let's go. I want to get to the mine anyway. Before we head out, though, I am going to wiki it to see if Robin's actually around tomorrow, because if she is, we're going to wait for her to open. And then we're going to go to the mine, because I want to get the silo built. For mostly so I can clear out all this, uh, all the grass. OK, I'm actually cutting it close. What am I doing? Um, sell the halibut, sell the herring. I don't know how much seaweed we already have. I want to save five for our first fish pond. Let's just go to bed. We can organize this in the morning. Rather do that than pass out. Boom, day one down. Level three farming. Plus one watering can, plus one hoe proficiency. We can craft a bee house, speed grow, and a farmer's lunch. Oh yeah, I forgot we sold the cauliflower. It's going to be a, yeah, decent haul. Okay. First things first. Robin. By the way, guys, this is really weird, but I do this all the time. I check the wiki really quickly. Okay, apparently raining, period. Robin's at home. 
Uh, I checked the wiki just to double check things. If for whatever reason you guys want to see what I'm pulling up on the wiki, let me know. Because I'm happy to pull it onto my other monitor so you guys can see it. I just figure it doesn't matter that much, but if you happen to want to see it, I can do that. Um, okay, ditch the bait. Seaweed, we have none saved, so let's start saving it. Um, Sandberry I'm going to end up selling, most likely. But let's do that for now. Let's bring the cave carrots. Let's... That's 13 energy, 23 energy. Uh, I don't know. Bring 10 of these. Um, get rid of everything that we don't need. Um, actually, I'm going to bring the fishing rod because we're going to fish while we wait for Robin to open. Uh, I'm going to sneeze in a second. I apologize in advance. Don't need those right this second, but it's good that we have them. All right, let's go. Uh, yeah, so if we fish just a tiny bit right now, um, we'll be able to get above two grand for tomorrow. So when our watering can's ready, we can immediately hand in the pickaxe, which will make mining, um, especially as we get to the lower levels, a lot easier because, yeah, if you stick with that that basic pickaxe, once you get to like the 40 and below where the, where the iron is, you gotta hit each rock like four times takes forever to get progress. All right. A little lake fishing. I'm going to go grab those, too. Oh, more up there, too. analogy. One other thing I'm actually going to do before we go into the mine that I just remembered. I confidently in an episode like two or two or so ago, I was like, I'm going to zoom out. Hope you guys don't mind. I'm going to zoom out. And then I zoomed out and was like, I think that looks fine. You guys let me know if you have a problem with it. And some nice person in the comments was very polite about it, said, you know you just admit, like shrunk your UI. You didn't actually zoom out at all. And the answer was no, I, I didn't know that. I managed to not realize that. So we're going to fix that in a second. Oh, my watch wants me to breathe, guys. Thanks. We've donated the bullhead already, apparently. Uh, let's go here. Let's get our UI scale back to 100. And let's zoom out to there. I don't mind that at all. So now I'm going to ask you guys again, now that I've actually zoomed out. If you have a huge problem with it, I will go back. But especially in the mines, it's nice to be zoomed. You know what? You know what? You know what? I mean, you don't. How could you? I'm going to go one more in, maybe. Maybe that. All right, Robin. Um, construct farm buildings. Why did I go backwards? Doesn't matter. It's right there. Hadn't actually thought about where I'm going to put this. Um, ooh, that's legal? Nope, that's legal. Let's do that. Let's not forget to get those those berries, too. Uh, okay. Now we can go mining. Let's dump some of this stuff off. Keep all this crap for sustenance while we're down here. Hopefully we can do, uh, well, let's try and at least get to 40. And maybe deeper. Maybe we can start collecting some iron. 
Oh, this pickaxe is just so terrible. Okay, ladder. I'm gonna go get all the copper that I can currently see before we go down. And maybe that quartz as well. No zombies, which is odd. Oh, here are bats. There he is. Hey, bud. Yep, that's a crappy sword. I always hate when there's like two directions to go and one direction has like four rocks. Because there's no point in going over there. But you know if you don't go over there, one of those rocks is going to be where the damn ladder is. Yeah, I know. I could have moved. And ladder? Yep. Where in the world would we need the... the mushroom already? Be the crafts room, I guess? Exotic foraging? Yep. We will, of course, be picking mushrooms when Demetrius comes and asks us what he, uh, what we want him, pardon me, to do with our cave. So there'll be no shortage of those, but we'll donate that one on the way by tonight. I think there's also a bundle on the bulletin board that requires some mushrooms, so... I should probably start getting some fruit trees planted. I mean, it's, I can't yet. We're obviously broke. Where? There we go. But I think we should at least try and get the fall ones planted during the summer. So that they will actually uh, yield fruit. Come on. Okay. I don't have the patience for you. Go away. Uh, they will actually yield fruit in the fall. And that way, some of the bundles that require, like, pomegranates and stuff. Since we're not uh, getting the fruit uh, bat cave option. There's always one silly thing I forget when trying to year one the community center. So I'm just talking out loud to cover all the bases, make sure I don't miss anything obvious. Oh, and somebody else pointed out, by the way, we were just looking at it. Um, this one's going to suck, by the way. I mean, yeah, it's fine. Um, I was thinking we had to get both of these, and I was complaining about how long it's going to take to get ancient fruit. But the sweet jam berry is easy to get, and we actually only need one of the two. So thank you to the person who pointed that out. I appreciate you. Nope. Didn't do a very good job switching tools there. Another thing that I find will happen in these mines a lot is I'll start doing what I'm doing, whoops, which is hitting every single rock on my way by just to find the damn ladder. And when you do that, you go around a corner, like we'll walk up this hallway and whoops, I thought he was dead. And the, um, the ladder will just be sitting there in plain sight and you wasted all your energy hitting those rocks.
Also, are these um are these mine floors always without tunes? I'm getting that nice uh like the wind uh sound, but no tunes. Whoops. See, they make a very distinct sound when they die, but for some reason that's twice now where I thought I'd killed one when I had not yet. I'm running away because sometimes this style of floor has an open... an open ladder, but I don't see one. <clears throat> That I could get away with not having to click my mouse 47,000 times. I think that's the dwarf squirrel we already have, unfortunately. What's it say? It does have a description, which I think that means Gunther's already identified it for us, basically. I would like to have smashed those barrels, but when you find the ladder and there's zombies everywhere, just go. Just go. Hey, here we go. The slingshot that nobody uses. Although I think it does actually come in handy on the islands for getting the, uh, what are they, are they walnuts? I the golden walnuts. You might need a slingshot for a few of them. Okay, yeah, we, we need a better sword. Alright, and now it's going to say reach the bottom. Pretty frustrating sequence of quests there. It goes reach level 5, and then you do, and it goes reach level 40. And then you do, and then it says reach level whatever the bottom is, 120. get to 45 or are we just trying to get some iron while we're down here that's the question either way is fine by me you know your sword's bad but trying to kill these little dust mites is uh taking 10 shots It's only eight. Three levels to go. It's possible. We might as well keep going. We don't have anything else to be doing. And the tunes are back. So we're having a good time. Damn, these are the same energy as the cave carrot. Not too shabby. Beautiful. Yeah, we gotta upgrade this pickaxe before we go any further. <laughs> Three hits for every single rock. Okay, there's the ladder. Let's see if there's any iron, though. This purple guy is something. I forget what comes out of it. Oh, leave me alone. My sword is too bad to kill you. Can't you just go away? That would be a polite thing to do. Got that crit. I heard it. Okay, got a ladder. Aquamarine, is that what always comes out of that rock? Alright, 
before I start hitting every single rock, let's take a look around. All right, we're hitting every single rock. Because we are one away from the next elevator. We do have to keep an eye on the time. Oh, hey, no, we don't. Any iron really close by? No. All right, let's go. Excuse me. Cool. Do we have time to hit the CC? Well, we're gonna. Where's Sebastian going? I mean, he's going home. Where's he coming from? Abigail's, right? They're, uh, they're buds. Um, this is exotic foraging. So it's down here. Real quick while we're here, let's do a quick hover. We do eventually need an aquamarine for a quest, I believe. Not a, not a quest, a bundle. Uh, that's our first jade. Okay. We can donate that jade to Clint when we go pick up our watering can in two days. Or is it tomorrow? It's tomorrow. Oh, there's a quest. What is it? Damn. That would have been nice to have gotten before we went to the mine. But we're not going back to the zombie levels. That's a shame. Oh, I also, I meant to go into the Adventurer's Guild to check for a better sword, but I already didn't do that, so... Uh, I forgot, you have the bars on these uh, screens when you're zoomed out. Not a big deal. Um, yeah, sell. Sell, we already have like six. We've already donated that, so sell. Save those. Everything else gets saved, I think. Um, okay, copper, geodes, aquamarine, jade, slingshot, bat wings all go in here. Let me grab my tools, get them in the right order. Where the hell is my watering can? Clint has it, never mind. Um, and we really do need to be above 2,000 when we wake up tomorrow, and I don't think we're quite there, so... Whoops! I don't think we're quite there, so. There's also a bunch more salmon, salmon berry bushes that I saw and forgot to go after, so we'll do that next time. Also, damn, man, October sucks. It is like 6.30 right now, and it's already basically dark out. Only gonna get worse. Nice. Caught ourselves an eel. Okay, seaweed. Useless at the moment. Useless at the moment. Right, we gotta go to bed. This is the last one. Regardless of what it is. Another eel. I think. Um, yep, we're going for it. Nice of the fish to drop down and join us there. Bait! Um, getting the next fishing rod is also on our list. But I mean, our list is pretty infinitely long at the moment. Okay, guys, that's actually going to do it for today. Let's see what we did. Level 3 mining, plus 1 pickaxe proficiency, new cooking recipe, miners, treats. And did we make enough money to get us above 2 grand? I think so. Yeah, we did. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm going to check what episode we're on so I can say it properly. This is episode 7. Damn. Going quick. 
Uh, drop a like down below if you enjoyed the video. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time for episode number eight. Thanks for watching.